Eleven years ago, earthquake-triggered tsunami caused a major accident at the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant. Multiple explosions ripped through the roofs and walls of some reactor buildings at Tokyo Electric Power's facility. These reactor buildings were ruined due to the explosion, but now, as you can see, it's covered. Under the cover, removal of spent nuclear fuel is in progress. As radioactive levels inside the reactors remain high, workers have remotely removed about 2,000 spent nuclear fuel rods from pools, or two-thirds of the total. Other things have changed outside the reactors. The operational environment has been considerably improved. Even without protective suits, like those needed immediately after the accident, we can report from here like this. The plant was likened to a field hospital just after the accident. But most areas have been decontaminated and workers do not need to wear protective gear there. Here's another change for the better. Perhaps surprisingly, there are two convenience stores at the site. Workers can buy their lunch, snacks, which make them feel more at ease. The plant also has a cafeteria where workers can have hot meals. Amid the progress, there are major obstacles that must be tackled. This is what remains controversial, the treated water. It has no color, no odor, and water just like this, which includes tritium, is released from nuclear power plants all around the world to the ocean. Water, highly contaminated with radioactive substances, is produced every day at the reactors. The water is run through a decontaminating device. But the radioactive element, tritium, cannot be removed. The treated water is accumulating in more than 1,000 storage tanks built on the plant, but space is running out. Such tritiated water has conventionally been diluted to certain levels and released into the sea in Japan and abroad. The Japanese government and TEPCO plan to dilute the treated water to 1 40th of the country's standard level and release it to the ocean starting as early as in 2023. However, the fishery industry is concerned that the action could damage the reputation of seafood in the area. 関係者の理解、国民の理解、ここが重要だと思います。正確でかつ分かりやすい情報発信が必要だと思います。将来的今後お魚を買うんですけども、その魚の安全性を証明したりとか、やはり目に見える形で、の安全性の発信も大事だと
slowly but surely.